What's up everyone, this is Autogus Tech, and today I'm going to be showing you something very interesting about your iPhone battery that you probably didn't know about, but it's also something you recognize. So, if you've ever been in a situation where your device is at around like 10% battery life, and you notice it slowly starts to decrease more and more, goes to 9%, then 8%, uh, I actually get kind of scared, you know? I actually have a fear of losing battery life on my iPhone, to the point where if my iPhone ever gets below 80% in public, I stop using it. It's really weird, it's like a weird issue I have, so I always have to keep it above 80%, otherwise I don't touch it. So that's my own issue, it's actually called nomophobia, it's really weird, it's probably not even a real thing, but uh, there's articles on it online. I'm sure I'm not the only one who's scared of their device, dying but something that made me feel a little bit better about this whole situation is that when your device is actually at one percent there's a few things that happen as to why the battery life will last significantly longer than any other percentage so for example if it takes two minutes for your iphone to go from nine percent to eight percent if your device is on one percent it may take around five to seven minutes for it to go from one percent to zero percent and then dead so the reason for this is actually i took a screen recording while my iphone was at one percent battery life and I noticed the frame rates dropped and the performance was significantly worse. And as soon as the battery life jumped up to 2%, the performance got better. And so I realized that as soon as your iPhone hits 1%, it kind of enters like its own extreme low power mode. And I don't know if this is intentional or if it's just glitchy, but I do know that my iPhone actually lasts longer when the percentage is at 1% versus you know, seeing it drop from 3% to 2%. So I don't know if you guys know this, but low power mode on the iPhone actually drops the CPU usage by 40%, and it can also slow down your frame rates just slightly. And so I actually found this kind of interesting because this is like an extra level of low power mode that I think your iPhone automatically engages, or it's just being glitchy because it's at 1%. But there actually is one more reason why your battery actually does last longer at 1%. So when your iPhone goes from like 98% battery to 97% battery, your iPhone is actually timing the amount of time that it takes to drop a percentage and then uses that to measure the other amounts of time it takes to drop even more percentages. And so if your battery life actually never ever reaches 1% or 2% on like a daily basis, your iPhone will actually misread its own information, which is why when your battery hits 1%, it has nothing else to base its measurements off of and therefore it may give you an inaccurate percentage of 1% when your phone is about to die. So I think that's kind of interesting. So thank you so much for watching, and as always, peace.